Are you trying to lose weight and get a flat stomach in time for beach season? Think that eliminating fat will help do the trick? Find out the truth between good fat and bad fat on this episode of Women's Ab Workout. Melissa from Women's App Workout here to tell you the difference between good fat, bad fat, and why you need fat in your diet to help you lose weight. So first let's start with why you need fat in your diet and what the fat actually does for your body. It's daily functions every day and why you need it. One, fat, the right type of course, helps your body absorb the vitamins and minerals and nutrients that it needs every day. So for example, it helps absorb vitamin K, E, A, or just a couple of them. Those vitamins are essential to the daily function of your body in order for it to perform at its best. Not having fat in your diet will prevent those nutrients from being absorbed and therefore you won't be functioning at your best. Um, and your cells won't get all the nutrients that they need. Even if you're taking supplements, you won't get everything that you need absorbed into it. That's why I need fat. Reason number two, you need fats in your diet is because fats actually um, aid in the testosterone production. Now ladies, I know you hear the word testosterone, you get a little scared, but I promise this is not a scary thought. Um, testosterone production is necessary for your muscles to grow. Having fats in your diet aids in this process. The more muscles you have on your body, the faster your metabolism, therefore the more weight you are able to lose. In order for this to even be possible, you need to be lifting weights. Um, you're not going to build any muscle. You're not going to have testosterone production if you're not lifting weights. So side note, make sure you check out a workout um, on and subscribe to the YouTube channel to check out some of the workouts that we have that will help you build muscle to lose weight and make this benefit of fat daily in your diet. Um, also, reason number three you need fat in your diet is because fats actually help you um, to lose weight. How? Well, they keep your body fuller for longer because they take longer to digest. So if you eat a fat, fatty food, healthy fatty food, um, your body's going to take longer to digest it. Therefore, you're going to be feeling full for longer and you'll be less tempted to go ahead and run for a sweet or salty snack that's not necessarily the best for you or on your flat dump stomach diet plan. So those three reasons, I'm going to insert a slide here, will tell you why you need fats in your diet to help you stay healthy by absorbing all the nutrients in your body. They help produce muscle and they also help you get slim by keeping you fuller for longer. So now, the biggest problem with all of this is to know which type of fats to eat. There is a very big difference. There's saturated fats and unsaturated fats. And there's also a really nasty type of fat called trans fat, but we'll get that one into in a little bit. So, the first type of fat that we're going to talk about is the good fat for you. Um, good fats for you are unsaturated fats. Notice that un saturated. For me, I remember it by saying that they're not saturated in fat. That's just my own gimmick. So if I'm ever reading something and I need to know which one's the good one for me or the bad one, unsaturated, they're not saturated. There's two types of unsaturated fats. Polyunsaturated fats and monounsaturated fats. Some examples of monounsaturated fats are olive oil, avocados, seeds, almonds, Anything like that is an example of a mono unsaturated fat. Those are all great sources of that as well. Polyunsaturated fats are often omega-3 and omega-6 combined. Um, you can find them in wild salmon, tuna. If you take a fish oil supplement, that's a great way to get those polyunsaturated fats into your diet. So in all those ways that I mentioned before that fat helps your diet, making sure that you include mono and poly unsaturated fats in your diet will help aid in those processes. Those two types of unsaturated fats will help you lose weight, will help your body absorb the nutrients that it needs, will help produce muscle without you gaining weight. Now, just like anything, it's in moderation. Don't go out and eat the whole jar of peanut butter because I said that you need healthy fat in your diet and that's an example of healthy fat.
everything in moderation. If you're eating peanut butter that has 30 grams of sugar in it, it's not going to help you either. So you need to make sure you're reading at the labels. I will have a link about reading labels for you video on that soon. But back to fat. So healthy fats are poly and mono unsaturated fats. The bad type of fat that you need to stay away from are saturated fats. The best way to know what a saturated fat is, you know, think gross, nasty, like a sponge, saturated in fat. These types of fats are fats that are actually solid at room temperature. So any type of fat that's a solid at a room temperature is an example of a saturated fat. Um, these types of fats, when added to your diet, help to raise your cholesterol levels instead of actually helping your body function. So you want to make sure when you're trying to lose weight, when you're watching your cholesterol, you're trying to live a healthy lifestyle, that you stay away from, away from saturated fats. Another problem with saturated fats is that they can then also increase your risk of heart disease. And as a woman, um, you do already have an increased risk of heart disease, so make sure you stay away from saturated fats in your diet. If necessary, I know it's kind of hard because there are times when it comes in foods or things that you're not aware of, but try your best to stay away from those saturated fats. Probably the worst type of fat out there are trans fats. Um, I'm sure you've heard the buzz on the news that many places are trying to get away from those. Trans fats are actually chemically made fats, and the thought of anything chemically made is pretty gross in my book. So, if you're trying to lose weight, get a flat stomach and get ready for the beach or whatever your weight loss goals are. Make sure that you have fats in your diet in moderation. Make sure those fats are poly and mono unsaturated fats. If you have any other questions, let me know. I'd be happy to answer them. Make sure you subscribe to stay tuned to all of the videos here on Women's Ab Workout that help you get a flat stomach. So, healthy fats, mono and poly, unsaturated fats. Until later, have a great day.